Hey everyone, it's me, NSA whistleblower Edward Snowfall. I have a knack for getting in places where I don't belong. That's why I'm so good at rooting all of the Android phones. I'm going to share with you some great one-click root methods so you can root your Android phone too. Now we're going to be looking at methods that are relevant in 2016 and still apply to some of the newer devices. That means I'm not going to be talking about methods like towel root, which is a great way to root your phone, but, you know, as my dad used to say, you just don't matter anymore. So let's, um, let's get right into it with these four great root methods, starting with King root is a one-click root method that comes in the form of an APK that you can download from the King root website. You might get a security warning, but just disregard that and go ahead and download the APK. Once you've downloaded the APK, just sideload that onto the Android that you want to root and run the application. Now King root is a simple app that you'll install right onto your phone. It'll instantly tell you whether or not your device is supported. If so, you just press the root button and the rest is history. This app currently supports the following devices. King Root is compatible with a whole bunch of different devices. Most Samsung devices you'll be able to root as well as HTC, ZTE, LG, Sony, and a whole bunch of Huawei devices. So during my time in the NSA, we had to break into a lot of different devices. And the method that had the widest variety of devices supported was called One Click Root. And we're going to be taking a look at that method next. One Click Root is a desktop application that will take care of everything from detecting your device to downloading the ADB and fast boot drivers for your device and then rooting it. It's going to be compatible with the following devices. One Click Root has a massive library of devices that it supports. Because of this, if you have a device that's not compatible with some of the other tools, chances are you're going to be able to find it using One Click Root. And then of course it also supports a lot of the devices for the more popular brands as well. Like Samsung, LG, HTC, Motorola, and many others. Now the next method that we're going to be looking at is called Kingo Root. This is another method that uses desktop software to root your phone. Kingo Root is a very easy tool to use. It's very similar to the previous method in the sense that you'll install some desktop software and then plug your phone into the computer and root it that way. It's going to be compatible with these devices. Kingo Root doesn't support a whole lot of the newest devices, but the ones that it does support are very popular, so you might find your phone on this list here. And the last method we're going to be looking at is called CF Auto Root. This method has been around since the beginning of time, and it's most popular among Samsung owners. So let's take a look at how it works. CF Auto Root will take advantage of the Odin software to flash a small file on your phone which will give you root access. CF Auto Root will usually work on any Samsung Android device that comes out. It will even work on some Motorola, HTC, and Asus devices as well. You can find links to any of the tools that I talked about in this video down below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and you can subscribe to the channel for more content like this. The end.